Yeah, let's start another run. Whew. I always need like a moment to like let those nerves flow out again. Like that pace was better than it looked, so that was why I was so nervous. Because there's uh, 50 seconds of time save on Volvagia that are pretty easy to get. As long as I'm not troll. And that water spit also has like 20 seconds save and I was on, on, on like track to get those. But those didn't show up and didn't show up in the splits uh, in the end, of course. Because the thing is, up until enter water split, the PB is pretty solid. Like, there's a stupid 20 second save on bombs. But the rest is solid, so if I'm ahead at enter water, that's like a really good thing. But um, what I always try to tell myself is, uh, we can do it again. Like, any run that is good, it's usually not coincidence that you get it. It usually means you're kinda at that level, so you can do it again. Maybe not the same day, maybe not the next day, but usually pretty soon. So you just gotta keep believing that. And continue. And also kinda enjoy the fact that you can get runs in good pace, because it does really feel good. Yesterday I hardly uh, got out of chow, and that was frustrating. And I guess I just had a bad day because today, the, the first two runs of the day were just... Actually, both gotten promising. And both made it to it all. So yeah, time for a little cola break. And let's continue. Because I really want to get that 53. And I really believe... Like, my level is at that point that I should honestly... Be able to easily get that, actually. Like, it's not even that, like, like tight of a goal. To look at my song best. But it is a short category filled with tricks. None of these tricks are um, are exceptionally hard, but there are just many of them. And I need to finish a run where they all go like decent. But I do allow myself to go a little safer now, sometimes, when I'm on good pace. For example, if I don't get uh, the ledge clip for enter water first try, I told myself I have to buffer it. <laughs> Just so that I like, lose less runs there, and that seems to be working. So usually if I fade it twice and I keep side hopping around, Things position slightly changes and like stuff gets weird. That was the weird inverted control frame that I got. Do, 
This dude, I swear. Still a right split for sure. Hey Moose, thank you. You just missed a run that was super, super good pace. And then it died to something sad. So now I'm a little bit sad. <laughs> but nah, it's, it's alright. You can do it again. Or something similar at least. Pretty late jump slash. But worked out fine. I never had that before. up was good at least. Yeah, there's what's kind of slow.
could get worse. Yo, Kiki. Yeah, it is kind of crazy. <laughs> I mean, I also played the game in uh, 98 already. It's kind of crazy how, like, <laughs> how different stuff is now. And I was also pretty young. So then I was kind of confused by everything in the game. Alright. It is super broken. But I think it's a good thing. <laughs> if it wasn't, I probably wouldn't ha be having as much fun with it anymore. Unfortunately. Like, I always loved the game casually. But after years and years, I mean, it's, it's kind of the same thing. Over and over again. Oh. oh, dude, come on. I shouldn't look at my splits ever. Because it is distracting. Really good bomb shoe split though. Man, compared to yesterday, I'm, I'm on fire, dude. Like, yesterday I just couldn't even, like, do the first three splits. Without choking kind of bad. It's kind of crazy how just one day difference. Like, what a huge difference that can make a different day. Chevy. Like I've been saying all day, being ahead, going into adult, really is a good thing. Uh, compare against this PB. Do 
Yesterday I was also super low energy. Like, I have the most fun streams when I'm able to, like, talk a lot. And yesterday I was just not feeling the energy. And it sucks, but sometimes you have those days. And also showed in, uh, in the gameplay. I went for a walk in the evening in the forest. Like four, like it was like eight kilometers or something. That was also really nice. Like sometimes I forget that, it's, like, that you sometimes have to move a little. <laughs> like when your hobbies are gaming and programming, it's really hard <laughs> to get some physical activity in. It doesn't involve just moving your wrists and fingers. I never really enjoyed like physical sports. Like, there have been things that have been alright. The most fun I had was um, I did like wall climbing for a few years. But yeah, most sports are still like kind of meh, especially ball sports. I was always picked last at gymnastics. <laughs> For good reason, I guess. Like, if you throw a basketball at me, I don't try to catch it, I try to, like, dodge it. Honestly, those things hurt when they, like, land in your face. Sometimes wonder if like how many developers actively like know about speedrunning and like consider this while making your game. Like when you make a new game, it's pretty easy to make it like really nice for speedrunning by like making stuff that doesn't have to be RNG, like not RNG, and making like cutscenes skippable. But you can also like be a huge troll. Can imagine like making a game where like okay like there's just where you just make like a, I don't know dude like a one out of ten chance that in the end you just get a random cutscene of like a minute or something or like r like making making things really annoying and random for no for no good reason. I guess maybe then people just legit wouldn't speedrun it or only for memes. I don't know. That's something I imagine, but. Like, if developers ever think about that, about their games from a speedrun uh, perspective. I think it's actually happening more that, like, wasn't, like, Celeste sort of aimed at, like, intended to be speedrun or something? Oh, really? Do they, Peaches? Yeah, I saw Celeste had a speedrun timer, for example. I basically, uh, I recently bought the game. Didn't play much yet. Yet. 
Oh yeah. Yeah, that's pretty neat. Yeah. Nah. N like, not for... Definitely not for the big Nintendo games. I wouldn't expect that they actively think about this. But I can see like more like indie indie developers taking it into consideration. On the other hand, I kind of like the beauty of of like stuff like RNG, you know, like it's part of part of life as a speedrunner. And also the cutscenes. Like I wish the longest ones would be a little bit shorter, like Master Sword cutscene. But like the little ones here and there, I honestly don't mind that much. Yeah, cutscene skips do make life so much easier and it's really easy to implement. Even if they just do that if you like beat the game for the second time. Or play like already beat a game that then the second time you can like skip them. Like then it's always possible for speedrunners. And it makes such a huge difference. 49 is actually decent by the way. Finally no flames. Didn't really save much time though. I'm really starting to believe that I frequently lose time on that split. Uh, because I probably mass master sword cutscene too lazily. That's true. Like the ways people go in this game to skip some cutscenes make the game actually really interesting, that's true. So I'm kind of glad most of them are here. Like also like in this category, right, we do three temples and we'll skip the cutscene after each temple. And one of them is even a wrong word. I think it's pretty cool. Alright, let's do this. Two extra buffers. It's kind of a lot, but yeah. After missing the one earlier today, being late, I go a little safer again, I guess. Like, not even like on purpose, that just happens. Very decent though, still. Oh. 
<laughs> Slightly weird back walk. All good. My God. Should give it a try. It's really fun. Are you like meeting more casually, or would you like to try a few tricks? Oh my god. Hey, Juke, thank you. Come on. Oh, it's gonna be slow. Yeah, nice. Yeah, it's also pretty good casually, of course. Yeah, exactly. What time do I think is possible on VC? Um, yeah, let me talk about that soon when I <laughs> I find a split kind of hard. Oh my god, why? Like, the VC record by Somrius basically drops both both hesses he does, so... Dang it. And also loses time to gold. Like, 30 seconds on Volvagia, I think. kidding me okay this is losing so much time i should have gone for it on buffer
You're not sure N64 is not faster. Uh, I'm not really like, can't you do 1 16th on a... Uh... Oh my god, I'm losing all my time because of that. Dude, that is so cruel. I hate this plan. Yeah, but right now, like, the world records are pretty far apart. Dude, this is fucking mean. Like, I always lose so much time on this stupid split and it's not hard. I'm mad. Are you fucking kidding me? Yeah, but fuck the wrong warp route, dude. I really like how this is like forest water, forest fire and water category. I think it should be like that. I'm gonna put like a like a no M runner. Pull a no M runner if uh, if people are gonna like change this kappa. Then I want my own negative category. <laughs> ah, I just really like this run. I'm mad, dude. I really know I can get a 53. But this stupid shit. And hi, by the way, aged. I didn't have time to react. Oh yeah, nah, those things shouldn't happen. Dude, I had a super good pace run before that was kind of like this, but then didn't fuck up enter water. But then I fucked up this cutscene skip because I legit forgot to damage down one extra quarter hard. So I'm still, I'm, I was pretty sad about that as well. But fuck 116th, dude, I don't want to do it. Yeah, it does happen. And like, I didn't expect that the next run would be at that pace again. Except that enter water was shit, but yeah. <laughs> well, I guess, I guess run warping into Nocturne like Hondo does, but I have no clue how it works. But that's stupid. And we should just make it no RBA, no wrong work, Kappa. Oh no, we do, we do a wrong work shit. Honestly, not sure if this is gonna work. My target on release felt a little, or target release felt a little sketchy. But we'll see. Okay, all good. Some fish. Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh, I didn't like how the camera was turning there. PC might be faster because I was actually thinking of trying this on N64 one day. But if the difference is not that big, I obviously always prefer VC. But yeah, then I have to do risky strats and shit. IQ, yeah, good meme. <laughs> Probably N64 by a bit, but if the difference is not big, I don't care. <laughs> like for two minutes, I would maybe switch, but not for, for like 20 seconds. Also not for one minute, to be honest. Well, I don't have an NT NTSC N64 yet, so I'm talking shit. Sub 50, dang, dude. Yeah, probably though, actually. Mod chip. No clue how that works. And I'm planning on getting an NTSC one. Real PB. Is there a different one on speedrun.com? Oh! Oh, okay. Wow. Oh, okay, so it's not a huge difference. Nah, I don't think Juke would lie about that for like a sick 9 second improvement. <laughs> Like, you know, if you're gonna cheat, go big or go home. Alright, I'll keep it quiet. Yeah, dude, Monka has. I mean, I never ever in my life played on NTSC N64, so I actually think if I would do it, I would get super salty because shit being different. Especially pause buffering, I'd probably say, nah, fuck that shit. Because, like, I don't like change, really. 
No, 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 no! Ah, oh, that is so stupid. Okay, it's not that bad, but yeah. It is stupid though. But the camera angle was kind of annoying. Oh no, I didn't. But I don't really follow that scene. <laughs> but yeah, if it's a good story. <laughs> But then how no video? Oh! Yeah. But you gotta record shit. <laughs> Alright, let's go. I got a huge time save on this bird. Everything right? Oh no. Well, rip 53. Okay, I, I should have I should have heard, heard that. Damn. Damn. Can I still save time though. Sucks. Yeah, they shouldn't accept it. a lot more but yeah let's go yeah 
yeah, things aged. I actually really looked at like that cutscene skip and like looked at way too fast, even with low health. Do damage down during the fight. The bombs. Yes! Oh, sorry for the super science. Hey, Wilco! Whew. My heart is beating, dude. Dang! So close, though. Oh! Yeah, like, it's crazy. <laughs> like, it looks like I saved shit on in Fire Temple, but... I, for my feeling, I lost like 30 seconds there because I had 50 seconds of time save. There's something really stupid at Fulpagia. But it's fine. It's barely not gonna be a 53, but... Loki, it was also my goal to beat Exodus and Mikami on the leaderboard. And this should definitely do that, so that's neat. I also enter water was so bad, but the rest was good, for sure. 
also the child section. Uh, Exodus, I don't know. And above that is Mikami with a 5427, I think. And then there's only two more people that play VC on the leaderboard. Uh, Real Time Attack 64 and... Um, and a world, VC World Record by uh, Sombrius. And uh, yeah, here's a link to the leaderboard. <laughs> But yeah, so N64 is probably faster, at least as long as I'm not doing crazy strats. <laughs> like it says a minute on child, at least probably two with blank A, but then it loses time on lag. Yeah, you're right, CTRN. But still really nice to PB, like I'm pretty big PB again. I really feel I improved a lot because uh, only f three or four months ago I got a 55-40. And then I was like feeling it was a really good time then. And I was really proud of it. And now I'm like so much better. It is kind of near, yeah. And then Duke, Duke is gonna come again and like set this like sick ass time on VC, really happy <laughs> that you can never get close to. Uh, like it's possible, like the current world, world record, it would require so much grinding though. Like so much. And I'm not sure. I want to do that for this category. But I still want to get a 53. Got really close today. Twice, actually. Nah, that's gonna be a low 54. You. Thanks, Wilco. <laughs> An aged and kick, kick. Not sure how I should pronounce that. Thank you, guys. Oh, like I'm still kind of trembling because I always, I get always so stupidly nervous for anything. Much better than previous PB, though. Obviously, that is definitely PB Momo. <laughs> Do it again. <laughs> It's just that, like, the child section is kind of annoying. Like, here I got through it pretty decently, and I was actually ahead of Master Sword. But, like, there are days I get, like, stuck in there all the time. It's really stupid. But today, I, like, on all the runs, I, I got out of it, so that's nice. The yeah, enter water cost me 30, 35 seconds, which is so much. Way too much. And then, yeah, Fire Temple. Of course. Like,. If you just if we don't get that extra extra Volvagia fly cycle, let's compare against. Best. Yeah, so it's one minute fifty two seconds from best. That's okay. -ish. It's a short run. Against balance period, that's always interesting to me. Yeah, so it was, and enter water was kind of bad. Then I saved a lot again in, in water. Magdalene Hammer was good. Fire Temple not so good, and the rest was kind of good. Oh, yeah, but fifth place. That was kind of my goal when I went back to this category, though. And like, 
fifth place and it's actually third place for this console because it's probably we're not sure probably not the fastest console for this category for now um so that's pretty cool actually and i think it's one of my better like one of probably my best speedrun time i have as in like execution and the amount of tricks i have to do of course stuff went wrong but that always happens uh, so we gotta grind another eight seconds to get a 53. I would want another step. I had to beat real time attack, but that's that's difficult. Man, if I just drop one bomb correctly, dude, then I would have it already. <laughs> but yeah, what if? What if? I must say I was kind of monka essing when I unequipped uh, the Kukri to or unequipped fire tunic uh, during the fire on world, and I saw like five seconds on the timer. Like I had practiced it before and I knew I could do it at that point, but I was like five seconds shit. <laughs> but it's just a pretty quick trick, so I think it's fine. But I was kind of monkey in there. <laughs> 